So we've made it to the end of section 20 and we've now implemented a shiny new feature into our application in terms of following and followers and we've implemented that from end to end and we've also taken a look at a self-referencing many-to-many relationship. So let's just take a look at the frequently asked questions and just one. How can I generate the relationship model that you used in the slides? And there's a site actually called vertebello.com and this allows us to automatically create the relationship diagram based on a SQL script. And we can get a SQL script of our migrations from Entity Framework Migrations. And then we can create a new physical model in Vertebello. And you do need to sign up to that, give them your email address, verify it, etc. But once you've done that, then you can use their sites. It's free to use and you can create the relationship diagrams. So you generate a SQL script for your migration, then you create a physical model, as you can see in the screen capture here, and just choose the SQL script that you create based on your code. And the command to do that, to create the SQL script, is to use one of the features of Entity Framework Migrations where we can get a script. And just follow that command and you'll be able to generate that SQL script. So up next, we're going to take a look at pagination in our application.